Hello everyone. Welcome to Analog IAS. Today's topic is Election Commission. It was established on January 25, 1950. Article 324 of the Constitution provides that the power of superintendence, direction and control of elections to parliament, state legislatures, office of president and vice president shall be vested with the election commission. At present, we have one el- chief election commissioner and two other election commissioners their salaries and allowances are same as that of judge of supreme court the appointment of chief election commissioner and other election commissioners shall be made by the president now let us see the procedure or procedure of removal of chief election commissioner he cannot be removed by office except in same manner or and on same grounds as judge of supreme court it means that he can be removed by president on the basis of resolution passed by both the houses of parliament with special majority on the grounds of proved mis- misbehavior or incapacity now let us see the powers and functions of election commission they can be classified into three categories administrative advisory and quasi judicial some of the advisory functions are they can advise president on matters relating to disqualification of mps and regarding MLAs to governor they can also cancel polls in the event of rigging booth capturing violence and other irregularities some of the administrative functions are deciding the territorial areas of electoral constituencies on the basis of delimitation commission act to notify the dates and schedules of election and to scrutinize the nomination papers and to grant recognition to political parties and also allot election symbols to them coming to the quasi judicial functions it issues the modal code of conduct for political parties and also candidates it also publishes the allowed limits of campaign expenditure per candidate of the political parties now let us see a previous year question based on this consider the following statements the election commission of india is a five member body this is false because it is a three member body consisting of chief election commissioner and two other election commissioners state num- statement number 2 union ministry of home affairs decides the elec- election schedule for the conduct of both general elections and by elections this is also false because election commission decides the elec- election schedule statement number 3 election commission resolves the disputes relating to splits and mergers of recognized political parties this statement is true so the answer is d 3 only thank you